Milwaukee has many of the same challenges as all big cities. But the city also has a lot of positives. Sometimes they get overlooked in all the violence we've been reporting on. But that is the point of today's Celebrate Milwaukee Day. And Michelle Fiore is live at City Hall with that part of the tale of two cities. Michelle? Hi, Mike and Courtney. Well, it's a day to be excited about all things unique to Milwaukee, like Summerfest or the new arena coming up. Well, we spent the day looking at the results of some Milwaukeeans who are working hard to make this city the best it can be. Meet the students of 95th Street School. Their test scores are improving thanks to MPS initiatives focused on core subjects. This school is one of the schools that was able to close the achievement gap in both reading and in math, which means the students here are growing at faster than the national average. 95th Street School typically produces average scores, but the GE and commitment initiatives are also helping schools with the lowest. From education to something else we all benefit from water. This time of year when the snow melts and there's a lot of trash around the city people can see and, and certainly a lot of that drains to the river, especially with a lot of the heavy rain and flooding that we've had recently. This weekend's the 20th annual spring river cleanup. Years ago, this was a smelly mess, but thanks to volunteers, the image has changed. You know, we have the river walk, which has been a great improvement downtown in particular. That's allowed people to get close to the river and, and really you know, enjoy it visually. But we also have, yeah, this huge influx of kayakers. And what better way to take in the river's beauty than with a ride on a bicycle? City leaders are excited about Milwaukee's new bike sharing business. We put a station up on Brady Street, which has been hugely popular. And most importantly, uh, this year we're going to be adding 20 to 30 additional stations to the 11 that we already have. here live on 414 Milwaukee Day. As you can see, happy hour just got underway. It continues here until 8 o'clock tonight, and we are expecting to hear from Mayor Barrett shortly. Reporting live at City Hall, Michelle Fiore, today's TMJ4. It's a party at City Hall. All right, thank you, Michelle.